to Storytime with Judy. Our book today is How Do Dinosaurs Stay Safe by Jane Yolen and illustrated by Mark Teague. Do you think that dinosaurs stay safe by doing dangerous things and things that maybe their parents don't want them to do? I don't think so. I think maybe they stay safe by doing the things their parents do want them to do. But let's find out how they do it. How does a dinosaur stay safe all day, whether at home or at school or at play? Does he climb up too high or jump on his bed? Does he race on his bike with no helmet on head? Is he rough with the cat? Does he stand up on chairs? When Mama says no, does he run down the stairs? If anyone dares him, does he always try to jump from the rooftop as if he could fly? No, a dinosaur doesn't, and I'll tell you why. When crossing the street, he holds Mama's hand tight, and he's ever so watchful to cross with the light. He's careful with forks, knives, and spoons when he eats. He never goes off with the strangers he meets. When swimming with friends, he is careful to be right at the spot where his papa can see. He wears a good helmet when riding a bike. Takes bottles of water when on a long hike. Always safe, never sorry. In playtime and fun, our dinosaur knows how to dial 911. He's careful, not fearful, so he's a big roar. Stay safe and play safe, little dinosaur. Well, those are all things we should do, right? So whether we're a little boy, a little girl, or a dinosaur, we need to make sure that we do those things, don't we? I hope you enjoyed this little book, and I'll see you again tomorrow. Don't forget to like and subscribe.